Hey guys, it's MCB here and what is up? Welcome back to another video. This is a follow-up tutorial to the animated scoreboard video I made a little while back. So I got a comment from Seher and they were asking me how to make it switch back and forth. Uh, I tried to explain it, but I know it's a little confusing. So in this video, I will be showing you how to make the scoreboard switch back and forth. All right, to get started, you'll need the command block. So give some CB command block. We also need some redstone stuff. So let's get some redstone dust and a redstone repeater and a torch to set it all off. So first of all, let's do the first command. So scoreboard objectives add v1 dummy. And this is going to be the first text on top. So maybe like we're going to say hello. Hello there. Uh, also, you can use color codes with this. If you want more information on color codes, check out my uh, second latest tutorial. All right, so we're gonna do that, and it's gonna be yellow. Hello there. Great, we added that. Let's do V2 now, so do the exact same thing, but V2, and I'm gonna say with red, I'm gonna say goodbye, sad face. Okay, so now let's do this. I'll show you how to do text on the bottom in a second. So we want to do scoreboard. So for this, these two command blocks will add right here. So here's my little system. Okay, so the command I want to put in is scoreboard objectives set display sidebar uh, v1 and it can be ascending or descending, so it's like 1 to 2, or 2 to 1, you know, depending on whatever we put there. So I'm going to say this is V1, and I'm going to say this one is V2. Perfect. So let's set this off, and we'll see what we get. So we get, hello there! Goodbye! Hello there! Goodbye, and you can have as many as you want. You can have V3, V4, V5, uh, as many as you need. Now, do not forget, you will want to put this in a ticking area. If you want more information on a ticking area, I can provide that to you in my animated scoreboard tutorial video. Yes, yeah, so you need to have this in a ticking area, so even when players are far away, this will still work. If you want to add text below, uh, what you do is scoreboard players add and we're gonna say under the hello one that welcome to the world and they're also gonna add a color code for that so let me just uh, alt 0167 and we're gonna have it as B. v1 and 1 so there we go welcome to the world beautiful and if you want to do it to the next one you'd say 2 you'd say 3 4 5 however many you want and for the next one, V2, we're going to say, this is under the goodbye one, remember. We're going to say, this is red, and we're going to be like, I'm sad. I'm just going to add that one there. So there you go. We have the two switching scoreboards. Anyways, to her, uh, I really hope this video was informative to you and to everyone else who wanted to know how to make switching scoreboards on Minecraft Bedrock. If you liked the tutorial, make sure to leave a like. If you have any uh, suggestions for videos or things you want me to try and uh, help you with, leave them in the comments section below. Thanks for watching. God bless you all. Bye!